But this is Edward. You know this guy, Jake, and this is your weekly update. Make sure you post this on all your platforms. If you don't post it, at least talk about it. Right, Jake? <laughs> Where would you talk about it? Just with your friends and small group and, you know, out oh. Chevron, maybe, uh, okay. Red Rooster, right. as you are going, I the tend, scripture says. I, I know, and I tend to talk about Jesus, not update videos, but whatever. Well, this has a lot to do with Jesus, I would think. So, uh, hey, great night last night, our children's ministry, and our youth ministry, and we're excited about what God's doing there. Uh, next Wednesday is the K through second grade, so if you have a kindergartner, through second grade, get them there next Wednesday night at 6 o'clock. If you have teenagers age 6th grade through 12th grade, Wednesday nights, 6 p.m., it's awesome. And also this Wednesday night will be the night that the Wednesday night small group meets with with Kristen Walker and her group. So if you're a parent, you want to drop your kids off and then go into that small group, be a good idea. Yeah, definitely. Hey, Jake, uh, notice that we're dressed a little different today. Yeah, normally you're in your workout clothes and I'm dressed up. Today, you're dressed up. I'm in my workout clothes. So here's the question. Did you work out? Well, not yet. <laughs> the, 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 the day's early. <laughs> Dude, really? You want me to tell them what time it is? 6.30. No, you lying second, Julia. Hey, also on October the 2nd, we're having a baby dedication. And if you have a child that has not been dedicated, this is not salvation. Some of you come from backgrounds uh, that that's a salvation issue. This is not a salvation it's issue. It's kind of like in the Lion King where the they come and hold the, yeah, the, the baby already, line you, up. already shared that. Anyway, that, it's just saying what that, this is. hey, parents, we're going to raise our kids in the way to that they would know Christ. And so we want to give you an opportunity on October 2nd, connect with Kristen, our preschool pastor, and she can get you all signed up for that. Also, Jake, we have a golf fundraiser going on. Four-person scramble. Get your team together. Sign them up today on the website shf.church or get a form on Sunday get so, your team registered so I've reached out to Phil Mickelson about possibly coming and being no on he my joined board. the live tour uh, yeah I know but I, I, I've reached out to him because they're making so much money for him to be able to get yeah. back so I'm hoping to hear from him to be my fourth and uh, real excited about maybe having Phil You're four, who, do you, who, who do you have can't tell you yeah, can't tell right. you so uh Hey, also, this is hard to believe. It came up in staff meeting this last week, Fall Festival. Yeah, right around the corner. <laughs> I, I blew my mind when uh, <coughs> Ashley brought that up. There's well, donations that you can start bringing. And if you want to look at those, uh, there's a board set up. And you can go uh, take a look, take that off, bring those back. Candy. Candy books. Books for the book wall. Turned in some books this yeah. week. Uh, we Signing did. up for some booths. Yeah, it's going to be a great day. I'm telling you, that's one of our favorite outreaches for our community. And this yeah. is a multi-church outreach. It's not just us. We host it at our building. Yeah, a lot of people involved. Other churches that come be a involved. part. It's your opportunity to minister and love on this community. And so, man, it's exciting. What, 2,000 people usually? 10 or 12. Yeah, that's my line, obviously. So I'm... Um, we're switching though. I'm oh, that's right. Today. That's right. That's right. That's right. So anyway, check that out this week and uh, bring those donations. We can't do what we do without you, both financially and how you serve and give. Uh, so check that out this Sunday. Also, Jake, that's interesting. Uh, we started a prayer time this last Sunday yeah. at 9 a.m. Yeah. in A101. If you want to come and be a part of that to pray over our service, over the people that are coming, our band everything that happens on Sunday morning. This isn't a time for us to come and give prayer requests or or to yap or anything like that. It's no to yapping. pray. It's to pray. And we're asking God to do incredible things in our service. And so come join us at 9 a.m. Can't get there till 9.30. That's great. Can't get there till 9.15. That's great. Just to come in and pray and enter into the presence of God. And, and let's ask God to do some huge things at yeah. Summit Heights. And speaking of, Jake, the last few Sundays, Speaking of huge things. it's been crowded. Uh, you oh, want to yeah. talk about that, a little SOS? Yeah, so the it, a lot of people are coming. We're getting a lot of visitors, yeah. which is cool. That's but, a great problem. That's yeah, great. But here's what I've noticed working on my first impressions teams. Here's what we've noticed. During the worship, it looks like every seat is taken. So a visitor will come in, and they'll kind of walk around like, man, there's no seats available. And then I get up to do the offering and announcements, and I notice there's little pockets of empty seats everywhere. Yeah. SOS. Yeah. So here's what we're going to ask you to do. SOS. Scoot over some or scoot in some. 
try to leave some of those outside seats available. That way it's so much easier for a visitor when they walk in for the very yep. first time, they see an empty seats on the outside, they can just go sit down. If they don't, they're a little hesitant to try to ask you to scoot over. And sure. really, you can't really see those empty pockets. So sure. what, what help great. us out with that. SOS. What, what, how awesome is that? That we had to add chairs this last Sunday. Yeah. Uh, people are coming in. They come in late. and uh, Somebody's ra drag racing well, down your street. I thought, I thought it was my street. It's actually out on the <laughs> Uh, so it's a great problem to have. Also, doing baptism again this Sunday. Uh, like if you're interested like in knowing more about baptism, get, connect with us. I um, love it. Baptisms are great. <clears throat> I knew that sneeze was coming. That's Did why you? I, you were filling in there. What else we got, bro? Um, man, weather's a little bit cooler. Yeah, it's nice. It's feeling nice. good. Football season's in full form. Yep. Uh, got a new set of tires on my truck yesterday. You needed tires. Yeah. You had wire throwing, showing through your And I get the most. I'm a good steward of my stuff, man. I, 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 I get I the most steward, out of everything I own. I think the steward's good steward, you went a little past that. I go the extra mile. You went a little past I that. I go the extra mile. Uh, so, Summit, we love you. Cannot wait to see you Sunday. 10 a.m. If you can't join us, join us online and invite somebody. This is your church. If you want it to grow, you invite somebody to be a part of it. It's going to be an exciting Sunday. I cannot wait to see you. Uh, have a great weekend and share this on your platforms. I'm turning the camera off right now.